close. One, two, three. What is this? It's your wedding present. What? It's your wedding present, sweetheart. Are you serious? I'm serious. A fucking yacht? <laughs> for millionaires whose ships have come in, pricey pleasure boats offer the most fun afloat. It's no coincidence that its 150 feet of green hull is the color of cash. Anchors away! <laughs> oh my god! Baby! Do you like it? Do you like it? Yes! Who's Venice? Huh? Who? 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 What are you, a fucking owl? Who is she? Well, I don't know. Some little hooky you a fat What's nut? talking about? No, no way, baby, no. You were calling her name in your sleep. What are you, out of your mind? I don't, I don't even know Venice. In Italy. Not Italy, California, baby. Oh, California. Yeah. You're a lying piece of... Duchess, baby, don't come on. Don't duchess me. Don't you duchess baby, me. I'm sorry. Do you Just really talk? think yeah. that I don't know what you're up to? You're a father now, Jordan? Yeah. You're a father now. I know. And you're still acting yes. like an infant. This is good. This is good. I okay. like this. Okay, so I will ask you questions about the products, okay. the people, and you tell me who you like and what. I don't know. They're both incredible. I mean, what a struggle. And you're going to sit here and talk to me about how amazing these two guys are? Is there anything bad about them? Okay, let me think. Flaws. I think there... There is one thing. FDR has these tiny, like, girl hands, like little T-Rex hands. Ah! Ew, gross. That means he's got a Mike and Ike for... <laughs> you know that's not true. You've seen it. <laughs> You've seen it in Bangladesh. You know that's not true. And Tuck is British. Mm. What is that? Hey. Hi. Uh, sorry I'm late. It's okay. I got a sandwiches. Got you turkey, no cheese, gluten-free bread. You sure this was prepared in a nut-free facility? Yes, I'm fully aware of your allergies. Hey, I'm here. I'm here. I'm really sorry. We missed your body as a wonderland. Okay, only one song. That's not so bad, right? Who's fucking your body as a wonderland? Well, the good news is he has so many good ones. Here's an idea. Next time, instead of being late, just shit on my face. Because that's kind of the same thing as missing your body as a wonderland. Okay, come on. We really got to go in. Julie Roberts is about to put on her really tall boots. Um... We need to talk. I think we should take a break. I just feel like we should chill for a while, you know? You're doing this. You're breaking up with me? You said I was your soulmate. I did? When? When we were at that bed and breakfast having sex. But, you know, that doesn't... That doesn't what? Count. I was tied up at work. I'm sorry. Maybe you should care a little bit less about work and a little more about the girl that you're dating. Because last time I checked... Work doesn't reassure you that liking a finger up your ass doesn't make you gay. I never said go up, okay? I just said lightly around. It's like a like a little button. You know what? Not your issue anymore. Is this why you were late? You were worried about how to break up with me? Oh, no, no. I was trying to decide what to wear. So you went with sneakers and a hoodie? Yeah. What are you going to take the SATs after this? I'll lash out, okay? You're better than that. I'm really not. I just think we're heading in different directions. Yeah, you to the John Mayer concert and me not. Thank you for doing this before the concert, by the way. Best breakup. He is the Sheryl Crow of our generation. Let me just ask you a quick question and just know that I am not at all crushed by this breakup. So be honest. What? Wait, is this a trick? No, just pure anthropological oh. research. Okay. You want someone to sweep you off your feet, but you're more interested in getting swept off your feet than the someone who's doing the sweeping. You seem like you've got it totally together, but you're actually really emotionally damaged. Also, you have, like, really big eyes, and that freaks me out sometimes. Thank you. It's enough. It is not you at all. Of course it's me. You can't say that. You're breaking up with me. It's not. It's me. I don't like you anymore. This is my fault. You deserve better than me. You're a great guy. A little too emotionally unavailable, if you ask me. I didn't. I really want to stay friends. Let's stay friends. Sure. Totally.